thing. So basically, I was always fighting in school for and then basically, wait, basically. This is your book, innit? So it's man's book. Of course. Always yeah. fighting in school, got to secondary school, got bullied, got robbed, seen like a knife, different things like that. Didn't get good grades. But long story short, I've been abroad to USA to box, to coach football. And also South Korea, different cities and business. So I'm teaching the resilient mindset through the comeback story. Done no. though. Yeah man. Hey man, then get the book, you get me? Man then producing their own books and offering offering their own books. We rate that man. Especially the biggest comeback, the best comeback, bro. Done no. With my brother, the vet, yeah, crazy, yeah. Real man them on the ground, yeah, pushing that real work, man, no time is, yeah. Big up all the man over there vent as well, yeah. Um, That's what I'm putting down for, yeah. Strong and do good. Your boss is still the king of all kings. Yeah. Be strong and do good. For us, the four is his name. So, Roja and leave. There's the last eye, and you will never die. Yeah. We keep man on your knees. Plead for forgiveness and shall pacify. Roja. In 2014, yeah, I was watching the podcast where he's talking about the man them and that, yeah, the old is telling him that you can't mock the dead no more and you don't mock the dead. Brother, you see with these youths, we've got to praise them when they do right things as well, not just when they do the madness and we've got to praise them when they do really right things, yeah, and I, I love that because we can't be cussing all dead and the elders, whoever told you that, big up yourself as well because that's the right teaching. That's the teaching the man grew up with. You get me, you don't cuss the dead, my brother. What's gone, is gone. What's sleeping, you let sleep, my brother. You don't do them things there. So, I love when I saw that, my brother. And I said, big up your thing and big up all the elders that told you that. You get me, that's the sort of order we're looking at, bro. That's the sort of order we're trying to reinstall, my G. No lies, bro, you get me? No, I'm saying, yeah. Man, am I taking piss out of the crowd and auntie, yeah? Eh, what? Well, can you take the piss out of a woman that's vulnerable, fam? It's good to be man's auntie or something. You're lucky ain't certain man's auntie. The man them are rolling around and taking the piss out of the auntie in credit. And, and no man them are getting up and stopping that. No man them are coming on the strip saying, Ra, fam, hold that down. You can't even do that. Move from around here. Are you taking footage of the woman and that and she's in a vulnerable state, fam? This is what I'm saying about this Generation Z or whatever they want to call it. You get me? Coming like they stand for zero, stand for nothing, fam, for a true. You understand where I'm coming from? Like it's a mad thing. The man them in credit should be getting onto them man and say, bro, you can't even do that on the strip. You mad. Take advantage of a woman on the strip, an elder on the strip. No matter if she's going through mental health or not, fam. What sort of men are we, fam? You get me? What sort of men are we raising and what sort of men are we out here now? We can't even stand up to things like that, bro, on the strip. That's a mad thing. Man them credit for stand up and put that to her end, you get me? Because if man goes up credit and that and man sees that, man's putting that to her end, you can't, there's no way man's filming that in man them's face, like real man them, and we're going to just watch that and be smiling and laughing. Remember I told man already, we don't like man that take advantage of people's illness and people's, you get me? Health and that, when it's deteriorating, we don't rate that, you understand where I'm coming from? Next thing I've got to chat about as well, yeah? At Foley done in tug of war party, I see one man send me some sutter man, I see the man them splashing out. And this is just in general, innit? But when I saw this thing, I just had to speak on this thing. You got the man them you got man them pouring like like champagne on you and wasting bare peas on champagne. Foolishness bro. Like of all the foolishness I've seen, even when I see certain man doing it and you get me? I'm like, yo, foolishness that you get me man don't respect no drink and money's pouring over man when you can put that money and feed people's fucking hungry belly out on the road fam. Man are starving out of your brothers and sisters, certain sisters are starving, certain brothers are starving, families are starving and you're pouring over drink over you like for a one night joke thing. Any big man I see doing that, I look at man as a joke fam, straight joke thing fam, understand? Especially ma big man, you know, dealing with things like that. Fam, so you go buy houses and them thing where with that money, you're, you're splashing over money, joke man, joke man thing. We don't rate that, you get me? Man have to stop, stamp that out of the culture ASAP, we're not in at that. You understand? Fuck any man pouring drink over them and wasting them sort of peas when you could be feeding kids, bro. Yeah, jolting anyway. We don't we don't rate that. We don't respect that. I have to talk on that. And as I said, the community needs to start getting a backbone and start standing up for what you believe in. I come to understand a lot of the community, they're scared, you know. Man, that's, people are scared. You get me? I've had people come crying to me about situations, yeah? But then they, they're crying to me, but they won't say it in public. This is the thing we've got as well. A lot of people want to say things behind the closed doors, you know, but they don't want to say it in public. That's the fear, that's a coward. Remember, I'm telling man that. Any man that can say something behind closed doors, you know, fam, but can't come out in the public or sister, whatever it is, yeah, you're a coward, straight. And that's what I find in a lot of communities. We're facing a lot of cowards. That's why we can't go forward enough because the cowards are holding back. You understand? Remember, this thing's about unity. So if it's about unity and we need 
numbers now and the character the cowards are holding back so we don't even need them then we've got a pattern without these people because they're just cowards in the community you understand where i'm coming from brother you get we don't need them anyway we know where it is and they know who they are they're cowards bro talking the talk hiding behind the thing when it comes to coming on the battlefield man don't come on the battlefield i see bear man you know madness on on the ground madness on the TikTok. man don't come on the battlefield though make make man make that call now Man, it come. You can't even see a man. A man's making bare excuses. Oh, I got to pick up my youth, so uh, yeah, I'm out. Of, I'm out of London, and gee, bare excuses. You understand where I'm coming from, fam? Just excuse after excuse. Coward talk, fam. You get me? If you're gonna raise up, raise up properly. I'm here to uplift my brothers and sisters. I'm not here to talk no coward talk to them. You get me? And as what I said on the credit thing, man up there, sir. Man up there, sir. Better pattern up them man there and tell them man to fall back off that. We don't take advantage of ill or ill willed people. You understand? We don't we, we don't do that. We don't take advantage of ill people, fam. That's not what we do out here, my brother. We pattern up different than that. We build armies, bro. We're real men and we stand up for what we believe in, G. Know that levels. You was a man that kind of this is the dead and a bit more than when it was like you get me yeah when it was all fun and games yeah basically you know it is bro it's calmer in it bro like mm. man was man was man was taught about these things bro you get it cuz mm. and obviously at the time when things are going good things go good then you realize when you get what i'm trying to say bro mm. but yeah man i don't i don't even believe in none of that shit there still so. you see you don't believe in karma Huh? You don't believe in karma? No, like this and the dead and that. You know what I'm saying to you, bro? Man's grown, in it, bro? This and the dead and all of that shit there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. man. It's not even, it's not even it still. What you say? You, you, you stopped now, officially? Yeah, hundred, bro. Man, not, man, not, man, not do them things, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Man was taught by the oldest still that 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 shit there don't run still. You okay, get? okay, mm. okay. So when you just done it, you just on a like. Man was young, bro. You get mm. man's just man's this and everything, bro. Mm. Yeah, I'm trying to say to you. Mm. I hear you. Yeah, man. Did you see like nowadays we gotta pray for them, bro? You yeah. Get? yeah.